Japanese automakers collectively falsifying data, hastening their exit from the Chinese market according to reports from Japanese media, on June 3rd. The Japanese Ministry of Land, Infrastructure, Transport and Tourism announced that Toyota, Honda, Mazda, Yamaha, Suzuki, and other five automobile and motorcycle manufacturers had engaged in serious fraudulent activities when applying for vehicle production certification. In vehicle safety performance tests, Toyota was exposed for submitting falsified data and improperly modifying test vehicles. These fraudulent activities involved several popular models such as Corolla and Yaris. The misconduct of Toyota and Mazda not only involved currently available models, but also included some discontinued models. Although Honda and Suzuki's fraudulent behavior only affected discontinued models, this fact still garnered significant consumer attention. Faced with this scandal, executives from Toyota, Honda, and Mazda convened press conferences to express apologies to the public. However, apologies seem insufficient to fully mitigate the trust crisis among consumers, particularly in the Chinese market, where the situation is becoming more complicated and could possibly expedite their withdrawal from China's market. China, as the world's largest automobile consumer market, has always been a battleground for major automobile brands. Japanese automobile brands such as Toyota, Honda, Mazda, Nissan, and Suzuki have achieved remarkable success in the Chinese market, with their products deeply loved and trusted by Chinese consumers. However, with the rise of domestic Chinese automobile brands in recent years, coupled with recurring issues within Japanese car companies themselves, the sales and profits of these Japanese automobile brands have been declining year by year. According to publicly available reports from Chinese media, the three major Japanese automakers' new car sales in China all saw year-on-year -year declines in April this year. Toyota's sales were 118,200 units, down 27.3% year-on-year. Honda saw a 22.2% decline to 73,831 units, while Nissan's sales dropped by 10.4% to 54,921 units. In fact, the decline in Japanese car sales in the Chinese market has persisted for several years, making their situation extremely difficult. Despite continuously introducing new models, intensifying marketing efforts, and even resorting to price reductions and promotions, their sales have struggled to recover. Conversely, Chinese domestic brand automobiles, represented by BYD, have shown strong growth momentum. They have won consumers' favor with excellent product quality, advanced technological levels, and good after-sales service. In addition to the problems within Japanese car companies themselves, there are also historical reasons that affect Chinese consumers' trust in Japanese brands. Japan invaded China decades ago, causing immense suffering to the Chinese people, yet Japan refuses to acknowledge or apologize for it, which makes it difficult for many Chinese people to forget. Although these historical issues are not directly related to the current automobile market, they undoubtedly indirectly influence Chinese consumers' car buying choices. For Japanese car companies, regaining the trust of Chinese consumers is evidently more difficult. Firstly, in today's Chinese automobile consumer market, traditional fuel cars are being phased out by the market, and electrified and intelligent new energy vehicle products have become mainstream. In these new areas, Japanese car companies are obviously not at an advantage. Secondly, in terms of technological innovation, Japanese cars, known for their low energy consumption, were once sought after by Chinese consumers. However, the situation has changed. According to the latest news from Chinese media, several hybrid models from Chinese domestic brands such as BYD and Cherry have achieved hybrid technology that can travel over 2,000 kilometers on a single tank of fuel. Some models have already been mass-produced and put on the market for sale, such as BYD Chinel, Sea Lion DMI, and Cherry A8. And this is just a new beginning, not the end. Lastly, it's evident that Chinese people haven't forgotten Japan's invasion of China. Despite decades having passed, it still affects their choices regarding Japanese cars. The level of competition in the Chinese automobile market is evidently beyond many people's imagination. In fact, in recent years, some foreign automobile brands have disappeared from the Chinese market as they failed to gain recognition from Chinese consumers. The repeated collective fraudulent behavior of Japanese car companies undoubtedly brings them great disaster in their survival and development in China. Based on realistic analysis, the combined factors of declining sales, trust crisis, and market changes may make it only a matter of time before Toyota, Honda, Mazda, and other Japanese car companies withdraw from the Chinese market.